Take me to a nice secluded spot. Is she into it? Is she? Maybe she sees the two guys walking towards the car. <laughs> <laughs> right. I think she might be a little spooked <laughs> by the fact that we just ba backed into this corner under the freeway in what appears to be a post-apocalyptic hobo den, and there are two men slowly walking towards her. It's, it's even creepier how slowly you're walking. <laughs> Hey, Sean, how you doing? I'm doing quite well, Danny. I've just moved to uh, California. You have, it's all the way from London. I know, it's really exciting. Uh, but uh, I'm having trouble integrating into the American lifestyle. You, on the other hand, you're actually American. I am American, and there's no better way to learn how to be American than by using Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, yeah, uh, bring me, teach me, show me, show me the ways to be, uh, to be American. All right, first thing you need to learn is how to drive on the right side of the road. Okay. I don't want you getting into any car accidents. So we're gonna go hop into my sweet car. I call this one Purple Thunder. That's, that's really cool, that's an American muscle car, right? Yeah. Gin and Juice, Snoop Dogg, he's an American. That's pretty American. Uh. So you guys drive on the, the right side of the road. We drive on the right side of the yeah. road, but I just want to show you that any habits you might be carrying over are gonna be incredibly dangerous okay. and potentially life-threatening in the United States. What do you guys do when, when you're about to be in a car crash? Do you just immediately jump out of your cars? Because that's what, that's what we do in Europe. We just <laughs> jump out, we just fucking bail. <laughs> get like that, out. see? Yeah, see? Didn't you... take a single bit of damage, yeah. which you probably can't say about this guy who's nope. slumped over in the driver's seat right now. So in America, if a guy walks up to you with a gun, what do you do? Well, you pull out your own gun. Okay. Yeah. Do you you always have a gun and a <laughs> I keep getting run over. <laughs> this guy's like our gun buddy. Yeah. He's like our friend. Is this how you meet friends in America? The most important thing about making friends in America is to always have a gun on you. That way you have a shared conversation starter. I get it. It's like an icebreaker and like yeah. common ground. Let's find a prostitute. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's a great call. Yeah. Actually, this car is busted, but I hear you've got like a good car sharing thing in America. That we do. So sir, sir, I need you to get out of this car. Okay. Also, in America, the one thing I warn you about you is the legal system. Yeah. So if you commit a crime, never leave behind a witness. Okay. I'm going to go to this pay and spray. Pay and spray. That's I'm sorry, funny, Los that's, Santos Customs. What's a pay and spray? Because that, that's funny, because that's actually what we call whorehouses in <laughs> Europe. All right, I found one of your American strip clubs. It's called the Vanilla Unicorn. That sounds pretty American to me. Uh, what? Do, how does this work? What do I do? You go into the strip club. Okay. And you tell them, "Excuse me, ma'am, I would like the American discount." So how much? But how much should I pay for a da for a, for this dance? I've only got forty-eight bucks, apparently. Forty-eight dollars, then. I've never got That's how much you should pay for that dance. I've got forty-six. The thing about being American is that you should never leave a strip club with any money in your pocket. <laughs> should I make it rain? It rains a lot in Ireland. I feel like I should share that with her. You certainly should. Whoa. Where are the damned prostitutes? Take it all. Yay, capitalism. Here we go. Danny. Yeah? I found a prostitute. Did you find one? Is she a lady of the night? She is a lady of the night. Excuse me, ma'am. I would like to take you to my friend Danny so that you might teach him how to be American. Okay, you show me how it's done. Okay, I want you to... Danny, I want you to come up over here. And I want you to watch me have sex with this prostitute okay. so that you can learn about being American. Are you ready? Yeah, I think this cop wants to come watch as well. Oh, I have to, it's telling me to go somewhere more secluded. So I'm just going to back my way in here. Just good? Ma'am? <laughs> can we have sex now? Have sex with her. All right, I'm going to go somewhere more secluded. How can this be more secluded? You just parked beside a bunch of homeless people. <laughs> There's nothing more secluded than that. Is she into it? Is she? Maybe she sees the two guys Shh. walking towards the car. <laughs> <All right. laughs> I think she might be a little spooked <laughs> by the fact that we just b backed into this corner under the freeway in what appears to be a post-apocalyptic hobo den, and there are two men slowly walking towards her. It's, it's even creepier how slowly you're walking, <laughs> and now you're getting on top of the car. She's never going to have sex with me for money now, guys. Come on. All right, I got I to gotta do this. This is for her sake. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Thomas. Like, I'm sorry, Danny. I need to find somewhere private to have sex with this beautiful woman. Come on, ma'am. She's freaking out. Ma'am, I need you to calm down. I just want 
you to have sex with me for money so that I can show my friend what it means to be American. <laughs> now she's screaming in terror. Where is, is she? She's right here. Ma'am? Ma'am? Oh, you just knocked her down. I was trying to stop her. She's Ma'am? She's okay. Ma'am? Ma'am, it's okay. Ma'am, please slow down. Please, ma'am. Please. Ma'am? Ma I need you to please, slow down. Please. Okay. Please. Okay. Uh, please. No, oh, Thomas no. is here. Thomas, don't Thomas, do it. Don't, don't Thomas, spook her. you got blood don't in your eyes, her. Thomas. Thomas. <laughs> Thomas. Oh, God. Please Thomas is down. a real wild card. You never know what that guy's going to do. Or maybe this hobo will have sex with me. Hobo woman? Oh. No! <laughs> Thomas is still just hanging out with us. Yeah. I guess, I guess I'm really friendly. I'm, I'm making friends really easily. Yeah, you in are. America. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Thomas, I think is taking care of the police for us. Yeah. Thanks, Thomas. You're a good guy. I've, uh, I used to grow up on the Atlantic coast, but of course here, uh, in America, yes. you're on the Pacific coast. Oh, yes. Can we, we have show some fun you... in the Pacific Ocean? Yeah, let's check out the mighty Pacific. The, the, the ladies in America are rather attractive. I don't mind saying. Whoa, who's that Whoa. guy? Whoa. Whoa! Who's that jerk? Oh no, Thomas died. Really, you're really doing a number on that guy. Yeah. He's fine. Can I get well, in on us? He's I, technically dead. He also makes me feel self Oh, sorry. Oh, no, I just Thomas. Watch, Thomas. watch out for Thomas. <laughs> sorry, Thomas. Danny, look at this. Look what I found. Oh, it's the American flag. Yeah. I Three, think... two, one, salute. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's beautiful. Excuse me, I need to poop. <laughs> I need to poop. Are you in here? Should we jump on the train and ride the rails like a bunch of hobos? We should. Is that American? Oh, yeah. Let's do that. Oh, oh no! Okay, get back in, get back I'll get in. Get back in. Okay, here uh, we go. Here we go. Okay, let's get out. Oh, Thomas. Is Thomas, it. you piece of shit. <laughs> Alright, here comes the train. Okay. Are you ready? I'm gonna follow your lead because you're American. You, you know how to do this. Here we go. Oh, Jesus, I did it wrong. <laughs> oh, no! Did you get on? I'm on. Alright, So is Thomas up. is on here, too. Alright, me and Thomas are just gonna do jerk off motions at each other on this okay. train. Oh, look, there you are. Yeah, I'm, I'm just, I'm driving up ahead of you. This is like when I was trying to get my visa and they were asking me all the questions about do you know how to hop on a moving train? Yeah. Do you know hobo glyphs? I lied then, but I'm... Oh, Jesus oh, no. Christ! I felt like I was close enough, but I was clearly... I clearly got murdered Are you gonna instead. be able to find this train? Cause yes. this train... I feel like it ain't never coming back. How's Thomas doing? Thomas is doing pretty well. Thomas is probably wondering why I'm just standing here. <laughs> yeah, he probably is. He either watches GTA Diaries and knows what's going on, yeah. or he's, he's, he's just a, the most passive Grand Theft Auto player in the history. Hey, what's up? Oh, look at you! Alright, you're gonna do this. I, I have faith in you, Danny. I may not be close enough to the train, I'll be honest. No oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, it you worked. made it. It worked. Look at you. What's up? Look at this big hey, old up, train Thomas? party we got. Oh, Thomas. Yeah. Look how majestic this is. This is beautiful. Isn't this great? I don't know if this is a little bit of American in me, but I'm starting to not trust Thomas a bit. <laughs> you think like, Thomas is untrustworthy? I feel like maybe. Because I'll be honest. I just took out a broken bottle, and I'm not sure why. <laughs> I feel like if ever there was a time for us to take care of business. <laughs> <laughs> it's perhaps, right now. Perhaps it's right now. Done. <laughs> Sorry, Thomas. Oh, Sorry, Thomas. Oh, no. We had to sacrifice you. I had to teach Danny about being an American. We only had two cans of beans. <laughs> we only had two cans of beans. <laughs> ah, smell that wind. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> smells beautiful. Oh. Smells like dead Thomas. Look at that. Oh, I hope Thomas finds us. I feel bad about stabbing him with a broken bottle on top of a train. I do, but I think deep in his heart he understands. He knows that I was just trying to illustrate a lesson. The American dream. Here we go. Are you okay? I'm good. I'm scared. You can do it, Danny. Oh, God. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Thomas is here and he just knocked me over. Oh, no. Okay. So I'm gonna get in the car. That makes sense. Oh, Thomas is being a real piece of shit. Maybe Thomas can bring us somewhere. Yeah, let's see where Thomas wants to take us. Oh, Thomas. Exciting. Oh, Thomas is a really crappy driver. Yeah, he is. Oh, look, Thomas' helicopter. Oh, and Thomas' and plane. plane. Which we... one do you want? Um... Thomas clearly wants the helicopter. Okay, we should get in the plane then. See you later, Thomas. See you, Thomas. See you never. All right, I think we should try to land on the top of that mountain. Okay, do you think that's doable? One of the things about America is that you just sometimes have to go by your gut. Okay. Oh, shit. I'm, I've run out of throttle. Give me a second. Yeah, okay. You should probably jump out now. And here we go. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I landed it perfectly. <laughs> oh, look at that. <laughs> I didn't even have to jump out. No. What uh, a perfect oh, landing. Oh, so did Thomas. Oh, Thomas is here. Oh, look at this. Look at this. This is beautiful. My favorite thing about America is how every piece of natural beauty has a tourist attraction. Yeah. Uh, stuck right in the middle of it. <laughs> Look at this. This is beautiful. 
Aw, oh, drink it in, Danny. Look at these bushes. I know, look at this one. This bush over here is... That's a, you don't get that type of weed in. No, you don't. Oh, look, oh, at, look at that, this Thomas. Guy. There's, there's, there's a, Thomas. There's Thomas is here. Yeah, look at hey, Thomas. Up, Thomas. Hey, buddy. Thomas, oh, he's oh, just Thomas, don't him. do it. No, oh, Thomas, don't do it. Oh, you're ruining nature. Oh, God, he's you just, piece of shit. He just spaffed all over nature. Oh, Thomas. That cost me a dollar, Thomas. <laughs> you're a real piece of shit. Oh, Thomas. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah, well, right back at you, bruh. Oh, beautiful. This is gorgeous. We're gonna base jump. I feel like this is probably not high enough to base jump from. You sound like a European right there. All right. Screw it. We're going to base jump. <laughs> Thomas is spaffing all over <laughs> nature. Fuck it. I'm doing this. All right. Do it. Oh, look at this. I'm base jumping from oh, the top shit. of the mountain. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I, I <laughs> fucked up. I European. Oh, oh, look at that. I can see you flying majestically through the air. Look at I, me. I did. I, I, I pulled out my parachute, but I was already eating rock by the time that happened. <laughs> oh, I'm base jumping down the side of this mountain. Am I doing a good job? <laughs> You're doing a great job, Danny. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm losing. I'm gonna invite you to my arm wrestling match. Great. And we'll have a true test of strength. Both of us have been practicing with our wrists all day, <laughs> yeah. so I feel like yeah, we have. We're we have very strong wrists. Here we go. I've never done arm wrestling before. What's he? All right. Oh no, 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 no! Oh, I'm gonna America you! I'm gonna win! Oh! oh. I'm the winner! There you yeah, go, Danny! Yeah, take that! Woo! I'm American! I don't want to jinx it, but I think you might officially be an American now. Oh my god! Yeah, look at that!